Last night, I failed. The moment of failure, and the atmosphere and the finality of it all and the audience, I was immediately rushed into a room and thrown in front of a microphone. I felt demoralized. Trust me, I know where I'm at and I've said it before. A person's character is not judged when they ride the wave of success. When everyone chants their name and you want to be their friend, no. Your character is put to the test when your back is against the wall. And for me, that time is now. Spent five minutes last night, five, feeling sorry for myself. And then right after that, I began to move forward. My last words last night were, I will figure it out. And that is my road to WrestleMania. I thought it would be the Royal Rumble. I failed. I thought it would be the Elimination Chamber. For five minutes, I thought it was over. Every single one of you can relate to this because this is what's difficult about failure. Disappointment is on you. It is your fault and you go through failure alone, but failure has made me who I am today. Failure gives you two choices. You stay down or you get up. Well, I'm up and I am fired up because I have figured it out. I have figured out that I need to stand in this ring and just plain old do something that I should have done a long time ago. Don't make the matches. And as obvious as this seems, I've been told that that match is not happening because that match, once again, is impossible. See, I told you, all of you understand. Now you all understand the disappointment of failure. And I can stay down or I can get my ass up and I'm in the getting up business. Well, I'm here tonight to say my road through WrestleMania goes straight through SmackDown. As a free agent, I will go to SmackDown Live tomorrow night not to beg for some pity handout, no. It is to do whatever it takes to hopefully earn a spot at WrestleMania.